Right now, investigators say that the man who drove down a busy bike path in lower Manhattan and killed eight people did leave a note saying that the attack was in the name of ISIS. Here's the latest for you. The suspect is identified as Sai Fulo Sai Pop. He's a 29 year old Uzbekistan national who came to the United States in 2010. Police shot him when he got out of a rented Home Depot truck holding what turned out to be a pellet gun and a paintball gun. Investigators believe he acted alone. Among the dead, five Argentinian tourists and one Belgian. Now, the suspect, again, is from Uzbekistan. We know that he has ties to the tri-state, though, as well. Nine on your side's Tamika Artist now has that part of the story, as well as reaction from a former neighbor. Good morning, Chris and Catherine. As investigators have been piecing together a motive in this deadly attack, nine on your side has been digging through the suspect's background. What we have learned and what we've been able to confirm from records and neighbors is that Say Fulo Saipov once lived in this Sims Township complex. In 2011, he registered a business called Safe Motors. Online records show he also lived in and started a business in Cuyahoga Falls in Stowe, just outside of Akron. Now, we spoke with two of his former neighbors, both in disbelief this morning that he's accused in a mass terror attack. Brooke Carey remembers Saipov is quiet and private. So we've lived here for about um, a little over two years, and I mean, when you show me the picture, that was him. I'm in complete shock, just total shock. I'm still in shock. It's really hard to believe. Sai Pav remains hospitalized and in police custody after being shot by police following yesterday's attack. Now, coming up in my report at 5:30, I'll have more personal reaction from people who knew him in the Cleveland area. That's where he lived in 2015. Guys, back to you.